Alright, I'm continuing right where we left off. Welcome back to some more RimWorld. We have a gigantic colony now. Well, to me it's gigantic. I don't actually know if it is. So you are a smoke leaf binge, whatever, you pothead. You can do it, whatever you want. Don't really care. Um, so yeah, back right into this. Uh, let see here. Is this multi-analyzer built yet? No, we don't have components. So I am going to actually go designate some mining of components. Right about now. So let's see, there's some up here. Oh. Auto save. Okay, there we go. Mind that. I'm not really trying to care about the efficiency of doing this. Also, since we're opening, I'm going to open this now and we can capture a guy out of here and try to recruit him. Okay. Capture him. We're going to try to recruit him now. Um, Shit, dog. I might make like a little kitchen area. I don't know. I want to make like a separate kitchen area, but like the way we have this all set up, it's gonna I'm gonna have to like revamp everything, and I don't know if I need to do that. I don't know if that's necessary. Probably not. Anyway, our places are clean now, so that's good. Um, resistance is four. What's your resistance? Twenty six. Yeah. Okay. Reduce his resistance, please. Okay. Um. Fuck. Uh, we have our mortar stuff right here. How many rounds of mortars did we make? Get rid of this. Alright, I want to make 20 shells. That'll be probably good enough, I'm assuming. I hope so. Okay, anyway, um, I'm thinking... I kind of wanted to make a caravan and do something in this episode. Is there anything we can do? Go trade, yeah, I guess we could do that, but like... How long would it take to go from here to like up here? About a week? Nah, not doing that. <laughs> I'd rather just use like those transport pods for that shit. But anyway, we're going to hunt the raccoons, tortoises... Guess we can hunt a buck. You guys are mining down here? Good, good. Get those components. We need those for the multi-analyzer. Um. Does everyone have a bed? Hang on, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six. <gasps> David, you were recruiting someone. Where are you? David, come here. You're gonna go recruit, um... Who's the best one here? You're really good at construction. Pyromaniac? Oh. You're a psychopath. Um, okay, well, no, we're not going to recruit you then. In fact, I'm thinking we are going to do this instead on you. Install, install, harvest. Okay, that sounds good to me. And then as for you... Install a peg leg on your right leg because you're missing your right leg. And then we will recruit you, meaning that David is going to come and recruit your ass. Or not. David, are you a warden? Yeah, you can be. Did you just... Oh, it's a sooth. Okay, I was really confused there for a second. What is going on? There's so many things going on. Oh, they're trying to do the operating. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Hmm. 
I mean, we're not gonna... We're not gonna, like, you know, recruit you or anything. We're just gonna fuck around with you, I guess. It's to level up the... Oh, are you operating on them? Yeah. Yeah. So, that's just to level up their medicine skills. That needs to be done. Multi-analyzer is installed, which means that they should be able to research a little faster, correct? I think so. Failed catastrophically on Frank again. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so bad. Oh my god, we cut off your right leg and put a peg leg on and... <laughs> we got a... You got your peg leg on though, you're fine. Your blood loss is severe, but you'll be fine. David. Why can't... I designate you to just go and talk to the fucker. Chat with him. Recruit him. There we go. Aha! We got a new person. Seedlings. Okay, um... I think that's actually all of my names that I got for my subscribers, because some of them I can't see their names, because I also asked them to comment, and none of them do, so... I guess you're not getting added unless you tell me that you're subscribed or whatever, because... I don't know. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm gonna rename this person to, uh, let's see here, what's, I don't know, what's, let's do Isaiah. Yeah, let's do Isaiah. I don't have Isaiah in here right now. Anyway, Isaiah, you are going to do mining 100% of the time. And then this is all gonna be second. Followed by constructing. Hunting's also going to be 100% of the time. And then firefighting's got to be number one, and doctoring too. Okay. There we go. So we got some boars tamed. Um, what's this? Huh, interesting, okay. Um, wildlife, let's see here. We got squirrel, a hare. Go hunt those. Kill them for meat. We gotta make sure we keep the meat stocks up, you know. That way whoever's making the meals can continue making the meals and shit. Um. We have some pemmican, but not a lot, so. That's gonna put a little dent in our shit. How... Okay. So. Hemmican. It lasts a long time without refrigeration. So, I mean, that means it's good for traveling, probably, but. Let's realize, like, why don't we just. How much does a package survival meal cost? Much ingredients are wasted. Okay. No one can make the package survival meal. Alright, fine. I'll just leave it as it is then. He's making pemmican now. You are cutting up the blocks. That's good. That needs to happen. Um, how good is your room? 1.2, 1.3. Okay, good. We have low food. What? We don't have low food at all. We'll make 50 meals. I know it sounds like a lot, but like we gotta have a large stockpile of food. Then we're also about to harvest some more potatoes, so that'll be nice. Um, did you guys finish the mining out here? I think you guys did, didn't you? Yeah, here. Let's designate some more mining someplace. Get a bunch of steel. Oh, there's some compact machinery down there. What else is there? What is... Um... No, we don't have to do that. Uh, fuck. Oh, here we go. More steel. Alright, I think that's good. Yep, I think that's fine. Okay. So, let's see here. Uh, you don't have a weapon. What are you good with? Shooting? Alright, cool. We got some... Yeah, actually, we got some good guns for you up here. Okay. We'll give you this gun. Heavy SMG. Uh, sniper. 
you are, uh, ironically, you're not very good at anything. So I guess we'll just start you out with a gun, because there's nothing wrong with that. You can have a gun. You'll get better with it eventually. There we go. Yep. Everyone's got a weapon, except Zaya. Zaya, goddammit, what are you good with? Oh, you're good. you're good at pretty much everything, so you can have the machine pistol as well. <clears throat> what are these? Insanity Lance? Wait a second. Can you use these? What, is it? what do these do? I don't know how you would use them. It doesn't say. Like, you can activate them, but I'm a little scared because it says... It says it'll drive the target into a rage. So what does that mean if I activate them, it drives my colonist into a rage? Or, like, what's... That would suck. Silver ore. What? This is silver ore? Whatever. Oh, God, you are mining very fast, Zaya. Jesus Christ, dude. I'll give you credit on that one. Damn. Okay, uh... Everything good to go here? Who's supposed to be a researching number one? Oh, yeah, here. No, you're going to be re researching 100% of the time now. Diddy. Oh, Sniper's doing it now. I actually want Diddy to do it, though. Okay, well, whatever. If I deconstruct these... Oh, okay, no, the bodies are still in there. Alright. I'm not gonna do that. That'd be a bad idea. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna cut until something interesting happens. Well, this is not good at all. We have an angry boomalope. Okay. Um... Yeah, you guys gotta put out that fire immediately. And that boar just walked through it. You dumbass. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> That's your own fault, you dumbass. God damn. You're on fire right now. What are you doing? No. No, 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 no. 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 Extinguish that fire. Over here. Okay, you're fine. Whatever. Oh god, Matt, dude, you lit yourself on fire. Yeah, go lay down, big man. Um, someone could probably come and fix you up. I want these boards to follow around, like, Diddy and Sniper, because that'd be kind of cool. They're just kind of, like, walking around, and they just have animals following them. And then, like, if they get attacked, they can, like, send them out to go and fight. Oh, it's becoming winter time now, so it's a little little colder now. So that means that I'm going to have to make some like jacket shit. What? I'm confused why you guys can't make a jacket. Make a fucking jacket. It's not that hard. John was working on it apparently. So Make the jacket. Is this a jacket? That's a duster. Yeah, make that shit. Because people are getting cold. There we go. Midkim's a full-time tailor. And Smith. Alright. Well, whatever. Yeah, keep making that apparel. Okay, hang on. What are you, you've tattered apparel on? You're forced to wear that shit? Well then, take it off. Is this forced? No, it's not. Go find your own fucking pants then, Dr. Green, and stop complaining. Okay, we got another grand sculpture that's excellent quality right here. Where do we want to put this? Could put it right down here. How much is it worth? Almost a thousand. Um, 
How are you starving? John, go eat. There's plenty of food. Okay. I don't know where I'm going to put this, because, like... Uh... Who, where do a lot of people travel to? Right here? I put it out here. Would it look nice? Find out. Yep. So when people go through here, they'll be like, ooh, cool. Oh, finally. Good God. And there's a cold snap, too. That's not good. But, like, gee, this, this is going to be good. So I'll guard it by four. I wrote a $4,000 and an AI person to persona thing. How close is it? Let me pause the game here. 2.7 days. We can do it. I want to do it immediately. Um, I know it's during a cold snap, but I mean, I guess we're... We have clothing for it. I mean, they're all dressed. Not like they're gonna... I don't think they'd die, would, would they? I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, no, we're gonna make the caravan right now. So, we're gonna take along... Let's see here. Bolt action rifle. Submachine gun. Submachine gun. The lance guy for long range. And we're gonna leave the sheriff behind. We'll take Isaiah with us. There we go. That's five. Five people. Good enough. Okay. So that... Right there only lasts us half a day. What? Damn. Okay. Uh. Shit. Okay. So. If you guys. See here. You guys can't. No, that won't make a difference if you guys took that. Take rice? Okay. Let's reduce this a bit. Okay, that's good. Right there. Okay. That should be fine. Here's root. There. I think they'll be fine. I don't think that anything bad's gonna happen to them. Except. Confirm. Okay. This is gonna be interesting, but it's gonna be worth it. Trust me, I know everything. It's gonna work. <laughs> oh god. Need warm clothing. My ass that thing that stuff doesn't even bother you when you're in a caravan okay that scared me just a little bit when i said that okay health oh hypothermia does bother you out there like that i didn't know that i was told that it didn't well, looks like we're gonna stick with it. <laughs> no, that's a bad idea. No, you guys should come back. It's not worth it. I'm not gonna risk everyone's out there like that. Come back and put your shit back. We'll, we'll wait until after the cold snap. I don't want to pull a stupid move and have everyone die. Another peace talks quest. Alright, I'll have to do that too. God damn. Okay, so we have no source of heat really. Um Should I just like have heaters pre built specifically for this event? Or fires? Can I just have it so it doesn't get refueled? Is there a way I can do that? Just like, don't refuel this. I can't. Okay, well. We'll do the heater thing then. Um,
Where should we put the heater? Let's we put one in here. We'll put one out here too. We'll have it get to like some insanely hot temperature. That way the, the heat bleeds through. I'm curious, what do you what are you thinking when you go through here and you're, you're next to this statue? Yeah. Okay. So it gives them like a little bit of a mood boost. Well, shit, dogs. All right, I, I'm thinking I might end the episode here. Sniper, you're. What do you mean you're idle? There's seriously nothing for you to do. You can't like go and craft. All right, man hunting. Llamas. The llamas are man hunting us. Okay, you have hypothermia. Bad too. Okay. Um. Yeah, this is not good actually. Okay, someone build a campfire in here, and like we need to do this now. Also, these um man hunting things are not very good, so we're gonna do the old um area one restriction here. While these animals get shot at. For a little bit here. Okay. Um, I regret doing that now. But anyway, we're going to do this now. Then what we're going to do is, since it's just a bunch of llamas. Go over there. You have a shotgun. So you can go over here. Shit! Hurry up, Geo Bjol. Okay, um. Run! Get inside. Jesus Christ, you slowed down a lot. Geo Bjol, you literally like tiptoed your way toward that door. That's your own fault there. That's not my fault. That is not my problem at all. That was your own fucking fault. I watched you do that shit. Okay, this is going to turn out really poorly for us if we don't do something big here. Um, fucking hate handling these things. Because, like, they run over here, and then they just get shot at turrets, and they want to destroy my turrets, and they can't just, like, fucking do something. Alright, so you, you're not affected by this, so. Get over there, like, immediately. Matt, get the fuck over here. You don't have a weapon that's worthwhile. And you're down. God damn it, Geobule. <sighs> Sniper. Go rescue him. <laughs> Monsieur, dude, you're a man. Just mowing them down, dude, like fucking nothing. Okay. There you go, man. Fuck them up. Come on, dude. You're doing good. Ah, oh, damn. Lars, what the fuck are you doing? Shoot. There you go. Good. All right, good. Rescue them. Oh, Jesus Christ. Good thing we have a lot of mess medicine and shit. Um, okay, speaking of medicine, we got that research. But anyway, um, someone's got to come out here and uh, make sure that you... Uh, melee attack that thing to death. You know, I think it's, it'd bleed out anyway, but... Okay. Okay. So you guys are getting fixed up. That's good. Now, as for the research, could make that fabrication thing to get power armor. Like, I don't... F I mean, yeah, it'd, it'd lead to the Starflight basics. But then there's deep drilling. Which... I feel like deep drilling would be nice. 
even though I've never used it before. So, I'm thinking that's what we're going to do. Deep drilling. I like it. Okay, you are not suffering hypothermia anymore. No, you're not. Um, where are the heaters all? Where are all the heaters at? Where'd I put them? I put two of them down. Isaiah, are you okay? <laughs> you're just sleeping on the floor. Probably because we don't have enough rooms, actually. I should probably work on that. Yeah, you... You need the... Yeah, okay. Um... I'm thinking I'm actually going to reinstall this into here. Let's, um... Could put it in front of the doorway. But, like, that would suck ass. So... Reinstall that there. <clears throat> okay, good. And then we're going to reinstall this into here. The reason I'm doing this is because I just noticed that everyone gets a bonus for having, like, a good dining room. So if we have an extremely good dining room like that, then, yeah, luxury, yeah, decent dining room, yeah, decent dining room, my ass. They probably have to go see it yet, to be honest with you. Once they see the dining room, maybe it'll give them a bigger bonus. Dr. Green, you guys... You're missing some body parts, that's okay. <laughs> okay, a bunch of things are dying from the cold outside. Where's the other heater? I put two down. Yeah, someone's gotta finish this shit. Who's awake? Geobule? Finish that heater, dude. You botched it. Don't botch it. Please, just fucking finish it. Thank you. Alright. So, yeah, we're gonna have these things here. And then, obviously, I'll turn them off when the cold snap is over. And then when another one comes back, then I'll turn them back on. But Oh god, the snow's coming outside right now, too. Okay. But yeah, if we just heat up key areas in our base, it'll keep the rest of our base relatively warm, or at least to the point where people get warm enough to be, like, not unhappy. Cold snap is over. Alrighty, look at that. Or we can already, um, toggle that off. Right? Okay, yeah, so it got turned off. And then this one also is going to get turned off. There. So now we have two heaters here. Okay. What are you calling this to idle? Why? I don't know. Yeah, it shouldn't be idle. Well, there's a bunch of growing to be done, guys. Why don't you guys go do that? Okay, here. Watch them all go running now. I'm going to just designate a bunch of things to get shot. Just mow them down. Jesus Christ. Alright, anyway, I think I'm gonna end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed. This guy's suffering hypothermia right now. He should be warming up, though. You're a pyromaniac. You're still alive? Didn't we take your lung? Harvest your right, left lung. If you survive that, then maybe. I'll think about it. Oh, we're operating on your ass. So, um... Anyway, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like and subscribe to see more, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.